I mean, first of all, it's <clears throat> important to appreciate that the Earth is almost entirely solar powered today, um, in the sense that the sun is the only thing that keeps us from um, being at roughly the temperature of cosmic background radiation, which is. Uh, it seems that training LLMs efficiently is a big focus for XAI. Uh, what's the, uh, first of all, what's the limit of what's possible in terms of efficiency? It, there's this uh, terminology of useful productivity per watt. Like, What have you learned from yeah. pushing the limits of that? Well, I, I think it's helpful. The, the tools of physics are very powerful and can be applied, I think, to almost any, really any arena in life. Mm -hmm. this, it's really just uh, critical thinking. For something important, you need to reason with from first principles and think about things in the limit, one direction or the other. So um, in the limit, even at the Kardashev scale, meaning even if you harness the entire power of the sun, you will still care about useful compute per watt. So that's where, I, I think probably where things are headed from uh, the standpoint of AI is that we, we have a silicon shortage now that will transition to a voltage transformer shortage in about a year. Mm. Ironically, transformers for transformers. <laughs> <laughs> you need you need transformers to run transformers. Somebody has a sense of humor in this thing. <laughs> <laughs> I think <laughs> yes. Oh, man. Fate loves irony. <laughs> Ironic humor and an ironically funny outcome seems to be often what fate wants. Humor is all you need. I think spice <laughs> is all you need. Somebody posted. <laughs> yeah, but yeah. So, so we're we're, we're have a silicon shortage today. Um, a voltage step down transformer shortage probably in about a year, and then just electricity shortages in general in about two years. I, I gave a speech for the sort of world gathering of utility companies, electricity companies, mm -hmm. um, and I, I said, look, you really need to prepare for a tripling of electricity demand. Um, because all transport is going to go electric, with the ironic exception of rockets and uh, and, and heating, um, will also go electric. Um, so energy usage right now is roughly one third, very rough terms, one third ele electricity, one third transport, one third heating. Um, and so, in order for everything to go sustainable, to go electric, um, you uh, need to triple electricity output. So I encourage the utilities to uh, build more power plants and and also to probably have, well, well, not probably, they should definitely buy more batteries because the, the grid currently is sized for real-time load, which is kind of crazy because, you know, that means you've got to size for whatever the, the peak electricity demand is, like the worst second or the worst day of the year, mm -hmm. or you can have a brownout or blackout. And you had that, we had that crazy blackout for several days in, in, in Austin. Um, so, uh, because the, o, o, there's almost no buffering of energy in the grid. Like, if you've got a hydro power plant, you can buffer energy, but otherwise, um, it's all real time. So, with batteries, you can you can produce energy at night and use it during the day. So you can buffer. So I, I expect that there will be very heavy usage of, of batteries in the future. Because the, the, the peak to trough ratio for power plants is anywhere from two to five. You know, so it's like lowest point to highest point. So like batteries are necessary to balance it out. And then, but the demand, as you're saying, is going to grow, 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 grow. Yeah. And part of that is the compute. Yes, yes. I mean, ele electrification, ele I mean, electrification of transport uh, and and electric heating will, will be much bigger than AI, at least in the short term. In the short term, um, but but even for for AI, the, I mean, you, you really have a growing demand for electricity for electric vehicles, and a growing demand for electricity for to run the computers for AI. Mm -hmm. And so this is obviously going to lead to a sh an electricity shortage. 